So a new game called Dragon Quest X is set to release in only Japan for the Nintendo Switch. This game is a massively multiplayer role-playing game and came out initially in August 2nd, 2012. But the Nintendo Switch port of the game will have a unique accessory that is a keyboard with something else. Now, Hori already has a light switch keyboard, but the unique thing about this keyboard is that you can dock your Joy-Cons on the side of the keyboard and charge them. Now, the Kotaku article I'm getting this from doesn't actually state the name of this keyboard, and I searched the manufacturer's website that was provided by the article, and I just couldn't find it. But because this keyboard is designed for the Dragon Quest X game, which only will get a release in Japan for the Switch, it's really, really unlikely that this will make it to the Americas or wherever else. But let's just take one moment to talk about this keyboard. So I don't see myself using this keyboard, or really any keyboard on a home console. I like things like the Xbox chat pad because typing with a controller is not, not easy and it's much faster to use something like a chat pad, but the thing is that using a full-fledged keyboard on a small little console like the Switch, it, personally, I don't think that would be a good idea. For me, probably some people will like it, I'm not one of them. I just think that they should do something like Xbox did with the chat pad, because the chat pad was just like a mini keyboard that you slide into the bottom of your controller, and it's much more easier to type. Of course, I'm probably not going to be using it too much. The only reason, of course, you'd be using it is just to send messages and maybe, like, talk. That massively multiplayer games, of course, isn't going to help the most because you got to send messages to tell your teammates what to do and all that. But still, I do think that Nintendo, if they do come out with an official keyboard, they should, ju they should just do something like Xbox did. Does that mean that this is bad? No, definitely not. Some people will like it. I'm personally not one of them. But I do like how you can dock your Joy-Cons on the side and charge them because that's unique and it's kind of like the grip that Nintendo sold separately with the Switch. You put the Joy-Cons in and it would charge it. So if you did find this video interesting, please leave your thoughts on this in the comment section below and share this video on social media and see you.